Hi guys, welcome back to Moon Moo Channel. So today we will see how the process of making new habitat for hippopotamus. Here we go. The hippopotamus or hippopotamus amphibious is a large African ungulate featured in the standard edition of Planet Zoo. Population in the wild is 125,000 until 150,000. The common hippopotamus or hippopotamus amphibious is a large mammal native to the rivers of sub-Saharan Africa. They are large, water-dwelling animals with long protruding teeth, nostrils on the top of their snout, small ears, and thick gray-brown skin. Males are 4 to 5 meters long and weigh between 1,500 and 4,500 kilogram, whereas females measure between 3.3 and 4.2 meters and weight 1,000 to 1,500 kilograms. Hippopotami face many threats. Chiefly, they are endangered by loss of habitat, conflict with humans over land, plus the threat of hunting. The species is poached for its meat and the ivory found in their teeth. Many areas populated by hippos are officially protected. But enforcing these protections can be difficult. Some areas are not protected at all. In order to ensure the ongoing survival of the hippo, further conservation and action is needed. Social. Hippos interact with each other but do not form close groups or bonds. Mature males are semi-solitary and territorial, presiding over a stretch of river and allowing groups of females and non-challenging males to live there. Females will choose where to live based on the quality of the habitat and thus there will be larger groups in better parts of the river. Hippos are known to be friendly to each other when in water, but can be aggressive towards each other when on land, especially when feeding. Reproduction Male hippos with better territory are more likely to be successful in finding a mate due to the increase in probability that females will select their stretch of river to live in. Males detect receptive females through smell, before following and vocalizing at her until she allows him to mate with her. The two mate underwater, with the female's nostrils often being the only visible part of her above the surface. Months after intercourse, the female hippopotamus will give birth, underwater, to a single baby, who will swim to the surface to take its first breath. The cats stay with their mother until they are between 5 and 7 years old, at which point they will leave to find their own area to live away from related individuals. Zupedia Fun Facts the hippopotamus's closest living relatives are whales and dolphins. The skin of the hippopotamus is 6 centimeters thick and secretes a red substance that acts as sunscreen. Hippos can open their mouths to 150. This is called a hippo yawn and is usually an aggression display. Hippos are highly aggressive and are the most dangerous large animals in Africa, killing 3,000 people a year. Hippos spend daylight hours in the water keeping cool and come out of the water at night to graze. They may travel up to 5 kilometers, 
and defecate on leaving so they can smell their way back to the water. so much for watching guys see you in the next video don't forget to like comment and subscribe this channel see you bye bye